Welcome to Grayon Math. We are asked to solve this problem. Both colored regions have area 10. What's the total area of the two rectangles? But before we go to the solution, may I request you to please like this video and subscribe to the channel. Okay, let us start by labeling the length of this larger triangle as A and the height or the width to be B. Okay, next is we notice that these two triangles have the same area and they have a common base that is this line or segment. Then for them to have the same area of 10, then if we draw a line or continue a line from this point to the point of this triangle, then we should say that this should be also A for them to have the same area. Okay, so next is we focus on this unshaded triangle here this unshaded one and compare it with the triangle which is the blue triangle so we can notice that the angle here this angle is actually congruent with this angle because of them being vertical angles and since these two triangles are right triangles then this remaining angle here should be congruent with this remaining angle here so they have actually a congruence with each other. If you focus on this line A at the bottom, then since these two angles, the 90 degree angle and this angle, the one I ticked two times and the other one by angle side angle congruence, then these triangles are congruent. Then meaning this leg is actually congruent because the triangles are congruent then if this is b the whole length then this should be b over 2 and this should be also b over 2 okay so next is we focus on these two triangles this yellow triangle and this unshaded triangle we again notice that this Two angles here are vertical angles and since they are vertical angles then they should be congruent then this angle here at the bottom of this right triangle beside the smaller rectangle this is a 90 degree angle and also same with this and if you have the two congruent triangle angles then this angle here is as a corresponding angle here that should be congruent. Next is we notice the fact that these two small right triangles are congruent because of angle side angle theorem of congruence again. This length is actually congruent with this length then these two angles then the side and this 90 degree angles angle side angle they should be congruent and since they are derived from this a total of a distance a then this length should be a over 2 for them to be congruent but have 
a total of a. So this is a over 2 also. Okay, so next is we focus on this shaded blue rectangle. We know that the area of any triangle is equal to 1 half times the base times the height. And it is given that the area is equal to 10, is equal to 1 half. If we consider the base to be A and the height to be B over 2, then 10 is equal to AB over 4. So from this value or equation, we can say that AB is equal to and AB is actually the area of this larger rectangle, 40 square units. Okay, so next is we consider the area of the two rectangles. So by inspection, the area of the two rectangles is equal to AB plus the dimension for the smaller rectangle is A over 2 times B over 2. So the area is equal to AB plus AB over 4. But AB is actually 40 as we got earlier. So area is equal to 40 plus 40 over 4. So area is equal to 50 square units. And that is our answer. Thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you like our solution. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. So you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.